Gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ, according to John. Jesus said, Very truly I tell you, anyone who does not enter the sheepfold by the gate, but who climbs in another way, is a thief and abandoned. The one who enters by the gate is the shepherd of the sheep. The gatekeeper opens the gate for him, and the sheep hear his voice. He calls his own sheep by name, and he leads them out. When he has brought out all his own, he goes ahead of them, and the sheep follow, because they know his voice. They will not follow a stranger, but they will run from him, because they do not know the voice of strangers. Jesus used this figure of speech with him, but they didn't understand what he was saying to them. So again, Jesus said to them, Very truly I tell you, I am the gate for the sheep. All who came before me are thieves and bandits, but the sheep did not listen to them. I am the gate. Whoever enters by me will be saved and will come in and go out and find pasture. The thief comes only to steal and kill and destroy. I came that they may have life and have life abundantly. The Gospel of Christ.
in joy and hope, let us pray to the source of all life, saying, Hear us, Lord of glory. That our risen Savior may fill us with the joy of his holy and life-giving resurrection. Hear us, Lord of glory. That isolated and persecuted churches may find fresh strength in the Easter gospel. Hear us, Lord of glory. That he may grant us humility to be subject to one another in Christian love. Hear us, Lord of glory. That he may provide for those who lack food, work, or shelter. Hear us, Lord of glory. That by his power, wars and famine and pandemic may cease through all the earth. Hear us, Lord of glory. That he may reveal the light of his presence to the sick, the weak, and the dying. That they may be comforted and strengthened. Hear us, Lord of glory. That he may send the fire of the Holy Spirit upon his people. That we may bear faithful witness to his resurrection. Hear us, Lord of Lord.